Welcome to Mindful Rhythms, the podcast that helps you find your inner peace and navigate life's rhythms with intention and mindfulness. I'm your host, Vandana, and today we are diving deep into 2024 with a focus on setting mindful intentions. So join me as we explore the power of mindfulness in creating a harmonious year ahead. Okay. So today we are exploring the different chapters towards mindfulness in creating desired life with the action plan. Isn't it exciting? So guys, before we go ahead, take out your notebook and a pen or open your digital notes. So it's important to capture those action points and start start implementing from today onwards. So guys, the chapter one is all about the art of setting mindful intentions. So what is mindfulness? Mindfulness is all about being present in the moment. And that includes setting intentions for our future. So we explore how to identify intentions that align with your values and bring greater purpose to your life. So right now, if you consciously look at your lifestyle, what you are living, living, you may be having lots of values, but you need to see whether to get the desired results. Are these values are aligning with those results? If not, then this is the time for you to change those values, to add new values, which can help you to get your desired results, as well as It will help you to find your purpose of this life. Now the time is to write it down your action point. So take a moment to journal about your core values and the intentions you want to set for 2024. Great. So chapter two is about embracing mindful daily practices. So mindfulness isn't just a one time thing, guys. It's a way of life. Mindfulness should be implemented in your day-to-day life, whatever you are doing, whether you are eating, sitting, whatever you are doing, you need to be mindful. So you can have the daily rituals and exercises which can help you stay grounded and present throughout the year. For that, you need to be Connect with us in a community where we are helping you out with the daily inspirations and daily positive mindset, how to make it and how to even create your desired goals. We are helping in that particular community. So be a part of this community and learn and understand this life meaning more deeply. So for the action point for chapter two is choose one daily mindful practice to incorporate into your routine, such as mind meditations, uh, deep breathings or mindful eating. That's really important, isn't it? Start by drinking a glass of water in a sitting posture rather than standing. Start with the one thing and see what results you are going to get out of it. Great. Now, chapter three. Chapter three encourages us to cultivate gratitude and positivity. So a mindful life is a positive life altogether. You know, when we are so much grateful for our everything, whatever we are doing about our life, about our kids, about our body, about our organs, about the breathing, what we take, you know, so these are these small, small things which we need to be mindful So we'll explore techniques to foster gratitude and how this practice can transform your outlook and your relationship. So the action point for this guy is that start a gratitude journal and jot down three things you are grateful for every day. It can be your relationship. It can be your health. It can be your body. It can be your work. So write it down three things every day and see What will happen end of the 30 days? So, miracle. Watch that. Now, let's come to the chapter 4, which is mindful communication and connection. So, this will, this is about the mindful communication. You know, we will, we are diving into the mindful communication and 
connection so how we can with others can profoundly impact our well being yes or no so we'll discuss in these kind of uh, chapters uh, the active listening empathy and mindful communication techniques that can enhance your relationship so join our upcoming webinars upcoming workshops and learn that how you can develop the active listening empathy and mindful communication techniques in your day to day life which can help you enhancing your relationship and it can give you the direction for the desired life so the action point for this is that practice active listening in your conversations with your friends and loved ones so start from here and then we are there for you to take it forward great now chapter 5 chapter 5 is all about resilience and mindful self care yes guys self care is very important and i as i always say the self care is not about the makeup what you do or the clothes you are putting the self care is all about your internal emotional library you know so you need to understand that what you think what you feel and what you do the action after feeling so it is all about exploring resilience and mindful self care so life has its ups and downs and resilience is the key to navigating them so we'll discuss self compassion and self care strategies to help you bounce back stronger so are you ready to come out stronger yes i know i'm sure you are so what's the action plan so the action plan is that create a self care plan that includes activities that nourish your mind body and soul now write it down and do share with me i love to discuss with you great now guys it's like we have to embrace this mindful living in 2024 and as we wrap this episode remember that mindfulness isn't about perfection it's about progress step by step moment by moment right so embrace this mindfulness living in 2024 one step at a time and watch how it transform your life so let's commit to practice mindfulness daily and even if it is just for few minutes or few seconds that makes a lot of difference in your life so thank you for tuning in to mindful rhythms and i encourage you to take these action points to heart and embark on journey of mindfulness in 2024 let's create a harmonious year ahead one mindful moment at a time so i'm vandana reminding you that within the rhythm of each breath there's a world of peace and presence waiting for you until our next mindful gathering take care and love you all